Yeah, bring on the acolytes of the big streamers. I know I'm getting somewhere. Finally starting to get my dislikes on videos and shit. I thought that was really weird. <laughs> I put out like 20 videos and never had a dislike. I think something's weird here. Maybe, maybe it's a bunch of bots trying to make me feel good. I don't know. And then I get guys like Mr. Lone Wolf who's going to come on a channel and go, I didn't even watch it because I died, uh, uh, Windows 94 didn't exist. Yeah, I corrected myself, whatever, 95, and I said 93, whatever it was. I, mean, I was like six playing fucking Ski Free and Minesweeper because that's all you could really fucking do. Eat a dick, dude, for real. I didn't even watch the whole thing. I didn't even read your whole comment. The moment you put fucking options and shorting in the same sentence, you dumbass. God, man, I bet you follow the kid that's like, there's a reverse gamma squeeze. I just made that up and no one's ever heard of it because it doesn't exist. I just made it up and I'm going to pat myself on the back and so smart. God, you can't short, you don't short options. And my, my video, if you had watched other ones, the, the ones that other people are watching so they can learn and find out what's going on here. I'm not saying you can't directly short AMC and GME. You can. Some places, it's very, very expensive to do so, which is why they found another way to do it through ETFs. ETFs. If you watched any of my other videos, you'd know that. You would know that, kiddo. Fucking dumb shit, man. Don't, don't be coming at someone trying to tell somebody that they're wrong and you have no evidence and the one fucking thing that you said, literally, it doesn't make any sense. None. You don't short options. Options do not affect the price of the underlying directly. Even the only way that they do, when they run in the money, someone has to buy a bunch of the stock to make the price go up. Fucking people, man. I swear to God. It's wild out here. It's wild. Thought truth is like poetry. Everyone fucking hates it. Don't you can't say about TD. Uh, it's not just TD dumb shit. Go look at Charles Schwab. Go look at E-Trade. Go look at all the shit we were talking about at the end of June. All of us that know what's going on. How all these brokers were fucking upping the margin requirements. Ridiculous amounts. 200, 300, 400, 500 percent to borrow these stocks and the people that are trying to borrow them to short are already so deep in a short position it just doesn't it wouldn't make any sense it, they would immediately start getting margin called like immediately they would push their fucking portfolio so far in the red it wouldn't make any sense look at the options chain to see the shorting oh. Ugh. whatever man that shit's crazy to me Anyway, anywho, <laughs> uh, Scotty, my man, you're, I, I really think you're cussing too much in your comments. I think you are. You got to take the vowels out of cuss words, dude, because uh, they, they'll black it out. You ain't going to be able to see it. No one will be able to see it. You might be able to see it and that you posted it, but it doesn't come through. Um, and so that's why I usually take the vowels out when I'm writing curse words, take the vowels out. So they don't ping for keywords that need removed or shadow banned or whatever the case may be. Um, yeah, and believe you me, I, I love that you started a channel, dude. I love that you're putting information out there. That's awesome. That's all I want people to do. I want people to start putting this information out there, the truth about what the fuck is going on. Instead of having everyone, like I'm assuming Lone Wolf probably sits in fucking all those guys' live chats. I bet he's got a petition going for Coors to get his channel back or some shit. Um, Anyway, like, yeah, I, I want people out here putting the answers out there where everyone's like, why is this doing this? Why is this doing this? And these guys are like, I don't know, but isn't my hat cool? Look at my hat. Send me super chats. Ugh, shit like that. Oh, try to enjoy my weekend. Try to enjoy my Taco Bell. I've been on a very strict diet for like two months. I just want to eat my fast food that I haven't been allowed to eat for fucking two months. It's it. A good timing though, because nacho fries are back. Them bitches are banging. <laughs> All right.
Uh, anyway, I'm not going to ban you, lone wolf, or silence you. You are entitled to your opinion. Anyone at any given time is allowed to say whatever they would like on my channel. Ever, ever, ever. I will never, ever, 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 ever ban anybody. Say what you want. But make it educated before you do. And the fact that you were able to be like, that was never Windows 94. I feel like you're probably in your 40s, maybe 50s, and you probably barely know how to work your fucking phone. Let alone how the stock market now works, or how a short squeeze works, or how hedge funds and banks and brokerages who are working together, market makers, MMs, how they can collude to manipulate shit like AMC and GME. Yes, they could still short it directly, but that's not what is causing this. That's not. And there's very, 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 very few places they can do that. That's it. Very few places. Bringing up options. Options and shorting. Ugh. The only thing, guys, you know, the only thing options can do in regards to shorting, it can change, it can manipulate the data, it can manipulate the short interest, it can simulate ownership of shares to make it look like possible return shares have happened, and it changes the short interest and all that shit. It does not drive the price down like that. You actually have to borrow stock and then sell stock. Because stock is what changes that little ticker price. Actual stock. I'm going to eat my goddamn quesadilla right now and my nacho fries. I'm out.